Hi, and thank you for joining me today. My name is Ashton, and I work for the County of San Diego. We live in an increasingly digital world, and there are many applications and websites that you can use to make daily experiences more convenient and enjoyable. So today, I'm going to share with you a great free resource called PayPal. This app allows you to quickly and securely send and receive money for goods, services, and more. You can use PayPal to send money to friends and family and to pay for online orders securely at hundreds of your favorite websites. It can be downloaded to your mobile device or used from your desktop computer. Please note that due to updates and changes to PayPal, what appears in this video may look different from what you see on your device. Before we get started, feel free to follow along using your own device. The PayPal app is available on both iPhone and Android mobile devices and on your computer. You may also grab a pen and paper to take notes and feel free to pause or rewind this video at any time. You can find the PayPal app by searching on Google Play or the App Store. The app icon looks like this, so you know you have the right one. For Android devices, you can find it on Google Play, and for Apple devices, you can find it on the App Store. Once you have found the PayPal app with this icon, tap to install the app on your device. Before we begin, make sure you are connected to a secure, private Wi-Fi network. Connecting to a public Wi-Fi network can put your private information at risk. A secure Wi-Fi network will have a symbol of a lock next to it. When you open the app, you will be prompted to log in or sign up for an account. We will be signing up for a new account in this video. First, you will be prompted to enter your mobile phone number. Enter your mobile phone number and then click Next to enter in more information. Next, you will be prompted to enter your name and email address and create a secure password for your account. A secure password is at least eight characters and often contains a mix of lowercase and uppercase letters numbers, and special characters such as a dollar sign or an asterisk. Then click Next to enter more information. On the next screen, you will be asked to enter your address for billing your account. Once you have done that, read and agree to the terms by checking the box. And finally, click Agree and Create Account to finish signing up. Now you're in the app with your new account. This is the PayPal app homepage. This is where you can access account settings and view payment activity. All payments you make or receive will show up here. We will now walk through some of the main features of the app. We will start with personalizing your account. To help your friends and contacts recognize you on the app, click on this logo to personalize your account. On the next screen, click Get Started to begin personalizing your account. On this screen, you will be asked to add a photo. Click Add Photo to take a photo or choose one from your gallery. If you would like to take a new photo, you must grant PayPal access to your camera. You can also choose to skip adding a photo if you do not want to add one. Once you have chosen your photo, you will be taken to this screen where you will be asked to create a new, unique, personal link that others can enter to pay you directly. You can give this link to people who are paying you so they know for sure that it is you they are paying. Click Next to confirm your photo and link. 
From Settings, you can add debit or credit cards or bank accounts to your PayPal account. Click here to add or remove cards or bank accounts. We will be adding one of each in this tutorial. On the next screen, you will see information about linking your card or bank account. Click here to link a card or bank account. Now you can choose to link a bank account or a card. First, we will be linking a bank account. On the next screen, click on the name of your bank if you see it. If you do not see your bank in the list, you can still link your bank account. To link your bank account, you can search for the name of your bank. Once you choose your bank, you will be prompted to enter your bank account number. Now we will link a credit or debit card. Click here to link a credit or debit card. On the next screen, you can manually enter a debit card by clicking here. You can also choose to link a credit card by choosing your credit card company and logging in that way. Now let's send a payment. Click the send button to send a payment. On the next screen, click this box at the top of the screen to enter an email address, phone number, or personalized payment link for a friend or contact. You can also click sync contacts to allow PayPal access to your contacts for easier payment. Choose your payment recipient. Now that you've chosen your recipient, enter the amount of money you wish to send. Click next to go to the next screen and write a message or add a GIF or emoji. A GIF is a moving picture that is on a short loop and an emoji is a character that you can include with text and convey many emotions or messages. Then click review to review your payment recipient, amount, and information. Once you have clicked review, choose the type of payment you are making. You can choose friends and family to pay someone you know, or goods and services if you are making a payment to a business. Click next to proceed. Then confirm your card or bank account, confirm the total amount, and click send. You've just completed a payment. Once you have finished the payment, you will be taken back to the home page. You can also use PayPal to request money from friends and contacts. Click request to request a payment. This process is the same as the process to send a payment. You can also choose to split a bill, such as a restaurant check with others. Simply choose the person or people to split with, type the amount of money you want to split and PayPal will evenly split the money between all people. Now we will go over some other features you can use on PayPal. You can scan a QR code to make or receive a payment through the app. A QR code is an automatically generated code consisting of a unique pattern of small squares that takes you directly to a link. In this case, to another user's PayPal account. Here is an example of a PayPal QR code. You can use your camera to scan a QR code for fast and secure payment or have friends and contacts scan your QR code to pay you. Click scan slash pay to pay using a QR code. You can also use PayPal to buy and manage cryptocurrency. Cryptocurrency, or crypto, is digital money that you can buy with real money. You can spend cryptocurrency online on websites that accept cryptocurrency. Click Crypto to manage cryptocurrency and learn more about how it works. When you click Crypto, you will be able to see different types of crypto and learn more about it. From settings, you can also ask for help using the app. 
click help to get help. On the next screen, you can search for your question in the search bar, click on any of the common questions, or contact support for any other questions. Thank you for joining me today. I hope this video has helped you prepare to, for using PayPal to securely pay for goods and send money to friends and family. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our other how-to videos. These training videos were created to advance the Live Well San Diego vision for a region that is building better health, living safely, and thriving. Thank you, and continue to live well, San Diego.